a Garmin um, uh, instrument actually is a very sophisticated computer clock, really, when you come down to it. It's actually because time is distance. If you took the satellites, uh, you would have to have at least three, and sometimes they use as many as five satellites, uh, and um, dissect them, you would find that they're nothing but very sophisticated clocks, like an atomic clock, very computerized clocks, and by using these instruments, they can tell um, latitude and longitude by measuring the distance between the, the point on Earth, the geographical position on Earth, and the celestial position of the satellite. And you take three of them and you've got a triangula triangulation between the three different satellites and the point on Earth, and you have a fixed known position. And uh, so they made life at sea bearable instead of having to use a sextant which would take you sometimes hours to get a very good sight and sometimes you go days without not even getting a sun sight and because of the cloud over uh, overcast or at night you couldn't see the stars you'd have the same problem so a sextant uh, was a very modern instrument and very uh, an instrument was very accurate and it could be used to find a position at sea but it had some drawbacks and one of those was the uh, conditions your weather conditions and you have instant navigational reference points instantly you can tell where you're at latitude and longitude within seconds and uh, you can tell you when uh, your speed over uh, your actual speed that over the ground that you're actually traveling other than through the water you know because there is a difference you can have water speed be one speed and uh, speed over the ground because you're actually moving with the satellites actually tracking your actual speed so there can be a difference it's more accurate than your speed over the water. So Gonzales, uh, you think, endorses? I would think Gonzales would endorse strongly. He would be surprised. He could, it would be beyond his wildest dream. It would be magical, something he could not comprehend. Uh, it's, it's magic uh, for someone to think in the terms of having something floating around out in space that could be a clock out there.